Hello everyone, Zach Moore, aka BlueSparter107 here, doing some more online matches, just some quick match, you know. And we're gonna play some more characters, obviously. Uh, last time, of course, I did four out of the six Naruto Universe characters. No, not what I meant. I accidentally clicked that. I mean, granted though, I have, of course, updated my moveset. Uh, you guys won't see that for like a while though going by when the video is going to be uploaded, but we are going to do a Kakashi-centric round for the first half hour of this stream, and then we're going to move on to the bitch herself, Kaguya. We're going to like try to go through all the series characters and everything, so. But who do I want as my supports? Because we got a ton of options that we could be choosing, but I want to of course choose options that are more familiar to me. At the same time, no, I don't really just want to choose like a Naruto centric team. You know what, let's choose Rukia, A, because her support's good, and B, because she's a mentor type character. Um, but who's another mentor type character in this game? To someone. Maybe Piccolo, but I take issue with everyone fucking spamming Piccolo's thing. That's the only real reason why I don't like Piccolo in this game. You know what? Let's choose Kenshiro just as a fun backup, just because I can't decide. <sighs> Let's see who we get stuck with. I'm wondering just how good I am gonna be at Kakashi, though, being all by my lonesome. Like, automatically using him as the default character that I start off with. I'm gonna see how well that works. I just know, though, that Rukia's um, support skill is one of those other ones that's spammed. And this person has the exact same fucking idea. Except they also have Yugi, and their main is Zoro. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Especially if I get myself caught up in one of Zoro's moves that is unblockable. And there's a couple of unblockable moves in this game, and I automatically find them unfair. But at the same exact time, they're kind of fair, because, you know, unblockables are a thing that happens in games. There's unblockable attacks in Soul Calibur, so I can't really complain. But at the same exact time, though, I just find that to be kind of stupid. Like, it just shows how OP some of the other characters are. And the thing is, there aren't a lot of unblockable attacks that your character can have, I don't think. I know you can definitely not have Zoro's, because Zoro's only move that he gives off is the 1080 pound Phoenix. <laughs> so. Alright, let's give this a shot. Hey, Kakashi, it, he has nothing to do with what you just said, because he's wondering why the fuck he took a wrong Did he take a wrong turn? You're going like, I won't let you kill my teammates. Dude, he didn't threaten to kill your teammates. Ow, fuck. Ah! Ow. Okay. Nope, I'm going to do the lightning spell shadow. Ah, nope. Ow. Damn it. Also, Kashi's lightning blade apparently does not last as long as. Fuck. Sasuke's lightning blade. Ow. Son of a bitch. Wow, this guy's good to Zoro. I'm hoping for at least two wins tonight. Oh, really? You're gonna go dry? Are you fucking kidding me? Dude. I mean, I guess good timing and all, but why the fuck would you go in dry? Go ahead and use your magic formula. I'm still gonna throw off the common shuriken. Nope. 
Nope. Lightning blade, bitch. Ow. Shit, into the black position, girl. Oh, really? You're gonna do the trump card. I'm gonna try to block. I hope that works. This guy likes to go and fucking drop. Son of a bitch! Stop spamming the Black Magician Girl! Gosh damn it! Houston Josh, can I just give you a tip? You're not gonna hear me, but can I give you a tip? Stop going in dry! It just seems so terrible! Get out. I mean, get off. I don't, I don't want to see this guy again. Fuck that guy. <laughs> I mean, granted, I, I'm not the type to like to rage against people. I'm not the type to like to hate against people either. But I don't like that setup. I don't like when people fucking spam the same attacks too. Granted though, I have to give this guy credit where credit is fucking due. He knows what he's doing. And I'm fighting against Sasuke, Ichigo, and Kakashi. But he knows what he's doing. He knows how to time the ults just right. But, like, why go in dry? He could have easily finished me off there if he had first um, awakened. Or maybe he didn't. I just didn't pay attention. Alright, Sasuke. Sasuke. Mm. I mean, the way I played Sasuke, though, he seems kind of slow and bulky and everything, so I might have an advantage here with Kashi. <laughs> I guess he tried to summon Ichigo to help out, and Ruki managed to stop him. Why is this move moving? Why is this match moving so slow? That's what I'm saying. And I'm gonna kick you. I wonder whose lightning blade is better, mine or yours? Granted, though, he calls his the Onyx Dory. Um, it's only Sasuke, oh, not Sasuke, Kakashi that calls his version of the Dory Lightning Blade. And then he replaces it with purple lightning when things happen. No. Ow. Damn it, I'm freaking out. Alright, there we go. Not a bad first match. He, he decided to close the gap. I should have gone for Lightning Blade instead. Or Lightning Style Shadow Clone. Ow! Okay. Nope, you fell for it. And I'm actually surprised you fell for it. It's a pretty obvious tick to know when he's doing the Lightning Style Shadow Clone, and that's when he pulls out his book. Nope. Oh, okay. Shit! Granted, I could have probably gotten Smith too, but. Oh, he's gonna go and dry. It, it just makes Ichigo look bad. There we go. 
Shit, I ran out. I was gonna fucking awaken. But, ow. Fuck! Okay. Wow. This, this guy's really damn good as Kakashi. But, since I'm awoken, my lightning blade has an extra move. Guess what? I avoided... Good news is I have a round on the moment, so if I were to lose this, or if I were to have lost this, I wouldn't have lost a lot, and I would have still had a chance to beat him. But still, good game to that guy. Alright, that guy, I don't mind. He was awesome, and he didn't annoy me for one reason or another. But, anyway, so... <laughs> Kakashi's only level 23. I'm level 26. I should work on this. Oh. So you did a Yu-Gi-Oh thing. I like this Naruto picture. If you guys don't know who I'm talking about, um, I don't know how to pronounce his Twitter name, but uh, he's actually the guy who made Dream.exe. Oh, I'm fighting against a custom character who has Ruki as the support and uh fucking Kenshin. Alright. <laughs> Look at this asshole. <laughs> I'm joking. But I think he has Sabo's scar on his face, and then he's got that other eye that's looking pretty demonic. I might try to create one of my other custom characters at some point, but he's supposed to have demonic looking eyes, like they're gold, but they're black. Ow! Whoa, hold up. Did you just use my lightning blade, you son of a bitch? Ha ha! I, I avoided, but I also didn't hit him. Ha! Ah, crap, he grabbed me. Wow, okay. Nice. Oh, shit, lightning palm. Nope. You gonna do that? I'm gonna throw Kamui Shuriken at you. Shit. Wow, okay. Holy crap, okay. This guy knows what he's doing. I am worried. Shit. Now the thing is, I don't have any energy. Ah! Oh, why didn't that work that time? Ow! Oh, damn Shit. Seriously? Wow, dude, fuck this guy. I didn't even mean to switch there. Fucking hell. You're going in dry too, dude. Like, what the shit? I'm still alive. Nope. Fuck you. Ten you could tell. Stupid. 
That guy. Also, well, he called at the perfect time. So, hello. All right. In case you guys were wondering, my brother just called me because <laughs> uh, he was asking what we wanted for dinner. They were out doing errands, and it's past seven o'clock. So, all right. But fuck that guy. Okay, I, I can't stand it. I mean, let let me just put it this way. Okay. I love this game. I love when I get a tie and I get, you know, when we have to do a tiebreaker. I don't mind if I lose during then, but if there is such a wide gap between me and my opponent that my opponent is kicking my ass, I kind of get mad. I kind of get mad. All right. And if I feel very insulted, it's probably because of the fact that people spam their supports and that support would be Piccolo. Otherwise, though, like, you know, it's just salt. It's not me intentionally hating someone. It's just me being salty for my loss. So I hope you guys understand. I am kind of actually being, a, like, very loud right now, though. So I gotta try to relax a bit. Alright, we found an opponent. Who do we got? Another custom character who has Goku and Zoro. Alright, I gotta try to be more tactical with Kakashi because... While Kakashi is considerably weaker than his own students, especially Naruto and Sasuke, uh, he is a very tactical person. He makes up for his deficiency in chakra for the majority of the series by being tactical. And then all of a sudden he gets some kind of huge chakra boost during the war, which um, Nutsaka actually came up with a pretty interesting theory on that, which is the fact that it was all a psychological thing, which is pretty actually... It's pretty fucking awesome. I like it. I like that theory. It was all psychological that after coming to terms with his dad and everything and uh, talking to him that he was able to overcome his uh, past. And, oh my gosh, this guy is wearing her mask. He looks creepy. <laughs> Alright, that's a nice line. That makes sense. Especially when going up against a uh, fucking CAC who's not going to talk. Ugh, oh, pardon. Oh, gosh. So, here we go. I am. Uh, I'm kind of owning this guy, and I don't want to be, like, super evil. Anyway. So I'm hoping this guy is able to pull through someone. That's also why I don't spam the support. I'm, I'm not a support spammer kind of guy in this game. In fact, I kind of find spamming the support just kind of uh, rude, so... But I do kind of spam the Kamui Shuriken as Kakashi. Ow. Okay. He managed to get a hit on me. That's good. I don't want him to feel so salty about this. Ow. Okay. Nice. Can't that out right now, not in the middle of a match. Wow, that was actually a good uh, dodge counter. Like, it's not an official dodge counter, but like, he dodged and then he countered, which was nice. Alright, he awoke him, and he's. Oh, uh, he's doing it. Final flash. Alright, he, he got me fair and square, okay? I'll let him take that one. He deserves it because I did kick his ass in the first round. So, like, I'm, I'm not gonna complain about that one. Uh, 
Wow, okay, I managed to get him with that. I, I didn't expect that. He kind of ran towards me. Ow. Alright. He knew that was coming. Ow. Ow. Okay. Stop. <laughs> Please give me a break. Ow. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm, I've won one, so it's not going to matter if I lose this one. Here we go. And I'm going to own him with the Kamui Lightning Blade. Ah! Okay, he's still alive, though. So, that was a little too, um... ambitious on my part. Alright, right, so my friend was just messaging me asking if I would be up for One Piece. So I'm just gonna let him know that if I don't distract myself with this game for too long, then yeah, I'll continue watching Jump Force with him tonight. Or no, Jump Force, One Piece tonight. So I'm just gonna tell him that if he wants me to watch it, of course, to try to remind me again around 9 to 9.30. So that way, if I'm not doing anything, then we can just go ahead and do that. I wonder, would recent player show up? Yeah, he did. Okay. So, I'll, I'll message that guy probably after the stream and go like, Hey, you did a good job. If you only just got the game, you can get better. And honestly, I'm a newbie when it comes to Kakashi in comparison to other characters like Naruto. So, But I, I don't want that guy to feel bad about the loss. Because I feel bad all the time when I lose without winning at least once in the match. Especially when the guy's a fucking spammer. Alright, so this will probably be my last battle with Kakashi. I think I've done four so far, so I try not to do over five. I mean, I guess it makes sense that to end it off, I started this thing with Kakashi versus Zoro. Let's end it with Kakashi versus Zoro. That guy also has Ichigo and Jotaro, though. Ow. Somehow I don't think he was expecting that. I'm gonna try to keep the distance between us short. Ow. Shit. I mean, I should have seen that one coming. Shit. He's going in dry. And I didn't get the block in time. Of course, I'm kind of throwing the common shuriken so close because I thought he'd be farther away. Come on. No. I know better than that. Oh, fuck. Why are you doing the Getsu Gatensho so close? So I just love that the ninja style my character uses is a combination of Naruto and Kakashi. Ow. I think this guy is definitely a better Ichigo player. Will this work? I don't think it'll work. He's probably gonna hit me. Yeah, it's not gonna work. 
He's like, oh, oh, you're gonna, you're gonna try to do that trick? No, that's not gonna work. No, I'm not gonna let you get energy after that. Why do you keep going and try, dude? Especially with Ichigo. You should awake him before you use Ichigo. Just because of the fact that you can make him look fucking cool. Shit, I got Ored. Oh, but you didn't hold it. You shouldn't have hit. You got so close. Shit, he's going in dry. Oh! He's fine by me, because I'm going in wet. Again, I, I know how fucking... Uh, you know, innuendo-ish that sounds, and I that's exactly why I say because of how innuendo-ish it is. And... Actually, wait, hold up. This episode would probably be up before that episode. Uh, either way, though, <laughs> like, seriously, though, Kakashi's fun to play, and, uh, yeah, I refer to people doing their ults without awakening as going in dry. If you guys don't like that, that, well, that's on you, I guess. I mean, I'm probably not gonna stop. If I do somehow stop, then awesome. If not, then you guys are gonna have to deal. <laughs> Alright, let's change character real quick. Because now we're gonna go to the mother of all chakras.